I am Nash Brown and I am currently medically retired due to having fibromyalgia. Um, but when I'm feeling able to, I like to write and I also make uh, resin products and jewellery. My latest book is called uh, Healing is Powerful and it is called that because um, it amazed me how powerful healing really is and because um, of the impact that healing can have with allowing you to step into your power power sometimes that you don't even realize that you have until you realize you have so my poetry was um actually just something that came to me i was in the middle of trying to write an autobiography and i st struggled with that um with, especially with i think mainly because of the the things i had to write about it was so hard to put it in such a, a formal way and then as i'm trying to write i'm rhyming things without thinking about it and so then i just decided to go with the distraction of the poetry and before i knew it i had a compilation of poems that were enough to fill a, sh a short book so that was my first book which i called um Trimochi. Um, and then feeling a little bit more confident after that, I wrote another book, um, which I called Compassionate Corner. And then that led me to this book, which is called uh, Healing is Powerful. Um, and it is about childhood trauma, healing, domestic violence, mental health, um, miscarriage, and it also has the odd um the odd joyful bit in the in like in between just to kind of like break it up a little bit and make it a bit more um a bit more easier to to manage so for me writing is about expressing how i feel expressing my emotions and like when it's sad things and difficult things and when I'm writing about the trauma and the healing and stuff like that it's for me it's like putting my tears in word format onto paper because I don't really I don't cry very often even though sometimes I feel I sometimes I feel to but for me, if I'm if I am crying and you know things are like seriously, seriously, seriously like too much, and I'm normally dealing with more you know several things at a time, and it's I don't, it's very rare that that I'll cry. I don't really have a lot of memories of of crying because I'm so used to disassociating and and shutting down. That yeah. So instead, my words are are my, are my tears. And obviously, if I'm writing about something positive, love, life, a happy event, then obviously it's it's that emotion that that you're getting. The other thing I love about writing is how the way I I articulate things or put things together, how it touches people's hearts and souls, and how it opens some people's minds up and gives them like a new way of thinking, and it can sometimes change people's perspective or give them more understanding with things that they didn't know about and more patience with people who are maybe suffering with the same things that I have. Always write from your heart first, even before you consider making any corrections. Um, don't be afraid to share yourself because for me, ultimately, that's what poetry is about. It's kind of allowing people inside your mind in a in a creative way and giving a bit of yourself to them so that they can learn and explore who they are and, and other things. My books can be found on Amazon or you can buy them directly from me on Instagram or Facebook or TikTok. And that's it, thank you.